So you are the lowly demons who are trying to start a rebellion against the corruptorment? Hmm. I came to see for myself what kind of idiots would come up with such a stupid idea. But you guys don't look like you're worth the effort. Who is this impudent whelp? Listen up, rascal. This place is about to become the historical site of a bloody battle. You should leave before you get hurt. You idiots! Don't you know who I am? I'm Death Emizo. I am the Abaddon Commander. I'm in charge of the assassination task force run by the President. I'm also his one and only son. The blood of the greatest lineage in the netherworld flows through my veins. Now kneel before Emizo! What? The president's son? This is my chance. Say what now? You're the president's son? Allow me to kneel before you. I'll even lick your high tops. Uh, hey, what's wrong with you? Why aren't you groveling on your knees like this guy? You can't even figure that out for yourself? I suppose I can spare the time to explain it to you. Your father is the Netherworld President because he earned it with his own power and abilities. It has nothing to do with you. Your prestigious bloodline comes from your ancestors' efforts. It has nothing to do with you. That being said, I have no reason to prostrate myself before you. That's the reason. <laughs> that was a bit harsh. He is a mere wealth, my lord. Yo, yo, you better check yourself before you wreck yourself! Don't you, don't you fear the name of the president? Absolutely not! There are only two things in this entire world that I fear. Small sardine bones that get stuck in my gums and breaking promises. The president is neither one of them! Ah, that's whack! I don't have time for this! Hey guys, just kill him! So did you enjoy that little lambasting from Jim Hawking from Outlaw Star? <laughs> Here I come! I don't know the actress's voice, but that's so obviously who it is. Oh. I, I know exactly what it is. <laughs> that was magic change. That shit's insane. Basically, that demon fusion with the big monster, that's new. Um, but the monster, uh, the magic change. Um, it's, so far, it's a lot better in this game than it was in the last. Here we go. I like how even though I deleted my cat, they still gave me <laughs> it the magic chain flip. Yeah, it combines the stats with the weapon you have, as opposed to in the third game where it just replaced the weapon you already had, and more and the odds were that your item world weapon was much better than the magic chain weapon. Yeah, the good thing is, both characters will get ex experience, so it's an easy way to level up monsters. Who are a lot more useful in this game than they were in the other games. Um, you can... Yeah, there are, there are new skills, as you just saw. And that's one of my favorite parts. Just seeing all the crazy attacks, and apparently there's a trophy for witnessing all the special attacks in the game. So, <laughs> yeah, I, I definitely... Although I wonder if I even can because I don't have the DLC for Fallen Angel Flan. <laughs> God damn it. Nipponichi better release that. Ready for 
DLC later or something. Um, and what was the third benefit? Oh, oh yeah, not not benefit, but it goes away in three turns as opposed to two. So it's not really worth it at the beginning of a long fight because it's gonna because the monster's just going to go away. I don't know what to make of these giant ass monsters. They're not as strong yet as they should be. I guess you'd have to find a really good combination of abilities. And look at the and it's so hard to actually find space to fuse because they take up a cross shape. And the terrain has to be like perfect for the fusion to work. Okay, just bump them out of the way. But yeah, here's the cool thing. That's normally a one, a single target attack. Now it hits three. That's insane. And I had another fuse monster where it, the range used to be, yeah, a single row three, then became a three by three. That's nuts. Really nice. All right, let's get this chapter in the way. Huh. Ally boost. <laughs> this is kind of like really set up in my favor. I got a few little weapons I can get. So obviously I'm going to throw this ally boost panel onto the red. This. Get this by the ass. I think I'll that's you a lesson. Yeah. I think that's one of the main Brace reasons yourself. to play this game in English. Simply for time to bust some balls. Sexito. <laughs> His name is Sexito. Sure. Woo! Easily done with the 50% boost. Can't reach. Take this! Tempei Saito sure makes some catchy music. Ah oh, yes, did you see now I made Din in favor? Um. Well, I already had favor. I made Din in favor. And I made them all different personalities just for that. And I made the fiery one, the wicked one, the, the blue ice one, the calm, timid one, and the green one is just peppy. It's magic! Yeah. There you go. Like I said, worth it's it to have... Magic. Yeah. <laughs> worth it to have three different uh, mages for elemental damages. A lot of the monsters are anywhere Here from I 25 come. to 75% weak to certain elements. So it's very handy. Ready? I miss the... This guy three voices where they kept saying I say. <laughs> There's something about the idea of Spanish pigs so that's really funny to me. Sorry, Mexican pigs. Yeah, we on your side, Holmes. <laughs> See, it's so big, so you're automatically intimidated by it, but. Uh, it's, it's stats aren't really. Yeah, see, it has two of the mass psyche bonus, but it's the only one left, so it doesn't get any bonus at all. I think they're actually stronger individually. Time to bust some balls! See, what I did right there is I moved my character back into the base panel so that he would have one extra space of movement. Ah! So yeah, four people. Okay, someone's going to have to explain this to me. The human centipede! I just don't understand. Is that what that's making fun of? The human centipede? Time to bust some balls! I just don't see why that's a. <laughs> that is so cool. Weird for a four-person attack. It's like I, I've seen moves where they, you know, make a tornado and where they run around the world. And this one, they just become a giant bug. 
Whatever. Treasure. I believe the defense and the ally boost will aid each other. See, that, those pigs, the orcs. I miss the old voices. Then again, each unit does have three different kinds of voices, so... There might be one of the older ones. Remember, personalities. Ha! I'll teach you a lesson. Ha! My reach with my spells will get better, the better my proficiency with staves be staffs become. Prisoners are given a level cap, forcing them to submit. H how can you be so strong? Well, what kind of cheap trick did you use? <laughs> My lord's strength is unquestionable. That's because he is the... Sardine! Say what? You want to know the secret to my power? It's the sardines. Eat them, and you will get stronger as well. What are you talking about? Why would I eat sardines? You dumb bastard! I hate fish! Damn it! Let's get back to the main force! Listen up! This ain't over! I'll get you next time for sure! You got that? Oh, next time! That was a picture-perfect loser call-out. Simply exquisite. Oh no! My only opportunity! We've upset the president's son. He was really pissed. <laughs> I can't believe those powerless blowhards were actually appointed to the president's special task force. They have an ominous sounding name, but as far as I could tell, they're just babysitters for that insufferable brat. Oh, the netherworld has become quite a tepid place while I was away. It's rather disappointing. Lord, you still have no idea how much this netherworld has fallen. That is why you must now take over the netherworld. 
All is for my lord. <laughs> 